Chinese clone, possibly legit. Notice the difference in packaging, marking, color. This is more of a lighter color. Like I said, they do duplicate these things. This doesn't say can, and the packaging looks identical. It doesn't have that, but everything else is the same. This notice this is just a slide out kind of deal slide out this actually might be a legit battery packaging is uh very sealed it has the new canon logo that's correct too they started adding that uh, what else is cool with this it's glued unless the chinese are getting better and i believe there actually is directions inside of here between the two layers shall we open it Maybe we shall. Panasonic Energy. Hmm. Maybe that makes the battery. This could be legit. We shall see. The writing looks better than this one. This is the difference in the font. It almost looks like the original battery I have. Hmm. Actually, the writing is different than the OEM battery that came with that camera from 2013. I'm curious what the date says on this, but I just opened it up. Notice directions, which it should have, unlike this thing. This is definitely fake. That's fake. We're going to contact the seller about that, or uh, contact Canon, which we can't this week because the week went by and we didn't do anything. So this one is that. This is another eBay purchase, by the way. Another eBay purchase. Let's go work on this. Kind of got to destroy the package to get it. Unless the Chinese are getting better. And uh, they adopted this way instead of that way. So far, compared to this battery, which is a fake, this other Canon battery might be legit. The texture is off, but it is an old battery. The print seems raised, made in Japan, 2017, 5. Made in Japan, processed in China, which is probably correct. Because um, they are not making much in China anymore. This is squared off. Oh, I just dropped the key part right there. This is a key part right here. The, um, it's squared off, and that's more rounded. This is deeper, that's not. That's a little different. We'll inspect it on the, this one. It's hard to show, but we just put the battery in. The battery goes in very smoothly compared to this battery. That's definitely a Chinese clone. We're either going to contact Canon and report the seller. Perhaps they will uh, give me a free battery like they say. Or I'm um, just going to try to get our money back for that battery. Clones. This is legit though. You can tell by the packaging. So some things on eBay actually are legit, interesting, and some are fake. Or a list of fakes are just getting better. This is definitely a sloppy made fake. The plastic on a legit battery is usually is like a different plastic too. You see the clear plastic, the le more legit batteries seem to have a, um, a, this, a more like opaque plastic. This is what, this was the, uh, Wait, this was, that was the original, this is the fake, yeah, I'm getting confused here, this is the fake, 2015 fake, and the one on the camera is the one I just got, it had the style holder, but I got another NB11L coming, and we're going to do a review on that one as well, but that's how you spot your fake batteries so far. Now we're going to do the weight test of the battery. This was the one I just... Was this the one? This was the fake one. Yeah, this was the fake. It's lighter. Watch. Okay, 0 0.5. This one's legit. See? 0 0.06. This one's 0 0.062. No, 0 0.07, so heavier. See, the Chinese clone one is the lightest one. So far, what do we learn? Continuation of our other battery. Packaging, definitely a big thing. If it's easy to open, it's a fake. Like this one, you can just slide, slide it right out. It's a fake. I'm trying to do this one hand, but you see right there. 
bam, out. If this packaging looks like a Chinese one, which I discovered, I have to find that link still. I'll try to find it in a minute. It's a fake. If your package is hard to open, it comes with directions. Might be real. Did you see it's glued over there? It's kind of like glued on the top. This one's actually was real. It was an old battery, but it was real. Got that real cheap. Uh, this one we just opened. Def probably real. Again, directions, hard to open, has similarities of this packaging right here. Uh-huh. Uh, what else was the writing? The writing's definitely a big thing. That's the Chinese one. You notice the printing's not correct. Doesn't have correct punctuation. This one does indeed, in fact, have correct punctuation. The print is better than this. So, that is another red flag of the situation of the fake battery. Yeah, I'm not concerned process in China. It probably is now. This is, they just, oh, Japan. It's not Japan. It's China. The way the case looks, especially around the contact points, definitely a big thing. Notice even like the lock, locking area, it's better, um, it's a better cutout than this. The two little slots are. See, this one had some misspelled words. It doesn't have the A over here. It has the A over here. And what else does it have? The German, I don't think, was correct either. It had some. No, it's about the same. A little different. This probably is legit, though, I would say. This is weird. The font feels raised on it. I don't know if they changed that or not. This one's more smooth. I don't know. It could be a fake too. I just don't know. Another thing, if it has paperwork, make sure that it's printed on both sides. Sometimes the Chinese only do it on one side. And it won't be folded well and it'll look all wrinkly and stuff. Because they slobs. So that's another thing to uh, look for. The quality of the paper. If it comes with it. Found it. That was the listing. The packaging looks almost identical to the Canon package. It's just lacking a Canon logo. China. 14 people bought them. But that's definitely. Look like even the back of it. Just look at the back of it. It looks like. Somewhat like a Canon kind of thing. The front is nothing. All you need to do is print. Something on the front. Printed on the package. Even the uh, the opening looks identical to my clone battery. The packaging looks the same. It's just lacking cannon on it. The back. Look at the back though. The back's the best. Printed in Japan. Or made in Japan. But it's being sold in China. I doubt that. Look. It definitely looks like a cannon. Printed in Japan. It's like so phony. It looks identical to the packaging I got. But my battery is a fake. And this is a fake too. You can make this into a legit battery very easily. It's definitely the same thing I got. Right here. Same thing. Mine just says Canon though. They probably just printed Canon over this. That's all they have to do. Let's look at the rest of it. See, look at that. Look at this. Well. This sometimes not there, but there we go. Put can in there. Some other writing will look legit. Fake. Okay, so this was the fake one that, which started this whole expedition of uh, batteries. But I'm also thinking it did kind of have a legitimate Canon uh, watermark on it. Where that watermark? But where is this printed? Was this on the plastic? No, it was on the card. Okay, so that's definitely fake then. They could reproduce that. I was thinking I had it actually on here. You see the more legitimate batteries, they seem to have the mark on the plastic. And this marking is on the card, not the plastic. You know, this packaging that has the extra sealing uh, indentation over there. This one lacks it. It's glued on the back. This one, you could just slide it right out. 
that's the one we got today. I believe this is also legitimate. Again, notice the color in the light of the card. It's more of a pinkish red. It's more of a darker red. Again, different number, but very similar battery. And again, these two batteries are probably like the most cloned. And this is definitely a fake. This might be legit. I'm going to open it right now and see. Make the real, or good fakes maybe, they make it really hard to uh, pull out. You get directions, which should be printed on both sides. I hope so. It looks like it. Yeah. Batteries all the way on the bottom. You really have to tear the packaging apart to get the battery out. Yeah, this has slightly more of a um, opaque holder than this one. It's squared off, which is good. Might be legit. It looks like the battery in my other camera, 2017 battery. This very well could be legitimate. Could be. The edges look good. Again, what the problem is, anything made in China is, you have a legitimate Chinese factory. And then next to that factory in China, you might have a clone factory. So if someone works in a legitimate factory, learns the product, they walk across the street, they start making bootlegs of it or counterfeits, it's very common so China is bad that's why I think they want to make more stuff here to eliminate this from happening you know if it happens in this country you know it's made a little legit because they're not gonna be making clones like they do in China so that's my video a lot of fake things are out there